Good morning, welcome to another video. This is Mark from Hillside. We've got a lovely 2011 Audi A3. It's a 1.6 SE. This is the Technic edition. So a few little extras over and above SE. It's a 1600 petrol. In the blue, as you can see, with the cloth trim. Covered 97,000 miles. Full Audi service history with this car. Which is nice, because not everyone carries on the Audi service history after the warranty runs out. There is evidence of an Audi service plan that was sold mid-ownership. So, history with the car, the story with the car. It's a two-owner car. First owner had it a year. Looking through um, details on the logbook, um, I would say, in my experience, this car has been a staff car for an Audi dealer member. Uh, based on the company it was sold to, uh, provides staff cars for the dealerships. So I think this car's been bought from Macclesfield Audi for somebody in the Audi network. Now, Macclesfield Audi, I'm led to believe, are Audi UK. So it's quite possible. So anyway, um, first owner's had it a year, second owner has had it since. So second owner's had it since 2013. We're obviously on 2019, so nice ownership period. It is £200 a year to tax it. I've just done an MOT on it, and it's just had a coil spring. So fresh MOT, it's serviced up to date. There are some very minor stone chips which I've touched in, which you probably can't see from here. And I'll be honest, you probably can't see from five or six foot away. Sorry, the weather is absolutely horrific here today, and I've just I've been waiting to try and get the car out between the rainstorms. So apologies. A um, couple of marks on the alloy wheels. Um, again, I've touched them up. I have to assume that people will expect that this car is eight years old with ninety-seven thousand miles. It's not a new one, so I've done my best to make it as presentable as possible. But on my findings during the valet, there are no, there is no evidence of paintwork. It's HPI clear. Been very, very well looked after. So we'll have a little look around. So your tyres, again, probably about four millimeter Pirelli tyre. So. As people know, if you watch my videos, I think tyres are a pretty much a giveaway as to how they've been owned. So proper tyres equals proper people, because they don't scrimp on the tyres. Front end's in nice condition. Local car to us, up in Cheshire. Again, discs and pads. But recent, I think there is an invoice in there for discs and pads. There's no dents down the side. There was a couple of little touchings on the rubbing strip here, which I've done. Have a little look in the boot. All the tyres have worn evenly. So 60 40 folding seats. Original spare wheel, it's never been on, it's a space saver. We've got the locking nut here, everything that should be. The original supply sticker with the spec of the car. All nice and clean under there. Just have a look down there. Tiny little dent here. Not the end of the world. But again, Nice and clean under the arches. Look on the roof. Again, no big holes, no big dents, no broken paintwork. Windscreen's good. So, 97,200 miles, the car is due a service. Apologies if I led you to believe it wasn't. It's due a service, so if the correct price is paid, we will service the car. Starts on the key. We have, show me that, two original keys. 
and the original Macclesfield Audi fobs which is a nice touch daytime running lights as an option there you can put them on electric front windows obviously it's only a two-door multi-function turn that off multi-function leather bound steering wheel which is all in nice condition it's like new it's come up really well with the magic sponges air conditioning and then radio CD lockable glove box and then we've got some lovely service history I think I'm going to get out and go round there just while I'm here it's a five-speed manual transmission but as you can see all the plastics are in good shape leather bound um, handbrake levers storage and cup holders there auxiliary plug in there for your phone or whatever it's got the original Audi mats in it which I've left in again those who know me and watch the videos know that I keep things like original mats because they are expensive if you went to buy them from the dealer so this is where it gets good there is a print off of the service history there if you want to stop the video and you can have a look at it so brake fluid last done at 92,000 miles um, oil change service 82,000 miles there is an argument to say that it doesn't need doing but the car's telling us it needs doing um, so not sure whether that's correct but some of the main things that you might want to look at um, cam belt tensioner and water pump's been done and then they've signed up for an Audi service plan so again from this point here at 72,000 miles the car has been looked after by Audi and they like to make their money out of the service plans but if you you know you feel free to go through all of this lot um, but it's all Audi this is one's at Cheshire Oaks now which again is another local dealer to us um, interim oil changes brake fluid change spark plugs pollen filters you know it, it's all there I did see one for brakes let me just see if we can find this one uh, 18,000 miles 76,000 miles Replace front discs and pads at 80,000 miles. So they're good to go for, I'm going to say, another 40,000 miles from there. Bulbs and bits and pieces. So, properly looked after, if that makes sense. Original books. So, it has got the service book in there. And uh, a business card for somebody at Macclesfield Audi. So, as original as it can get, really. Um... I'll recap in a second. Um, I'm just going to show you something. I'll we'll show you in the back. So all nice and clean in the back. You know, it's a bigger hatchback. So yes, it is a three-door car, but you know, look at the leg room in there. It's not like a, a Ford Fiesta or a Vauxhall Corsa. It's it's a big, medium-sized. It's a big. It's a medium-sized hatchback. Two doors. So just to recap, two owners from new. Last owner's had it since 2013, full Audi service history with all the major services done, so cam belt. It's just MOT'd, I've just done a coil spring. Um, again, if the right price is paid, I'll change the oil and, and reset the service computer for you, just so you've got a good um, 12 months uh, before you need anything. Paintwork's all original, original keys, HBI clear. If you are interested, you can visit hillsidevehicletrading.co.uk there's plenty more stuff on there including this video um, you can also contact me on there or on my mobile 07595871083 thanks for watching see you soon